feel it because the frog <laughs> fever has quite literally taken over Fort Worth. It's Pur everywhere. Purple and white everywhere. <laughs> the eighth ranked TCU Horned Frogs are undefeated. Tomorrow's matchup against fellow ranked Kansas State is shaping up to be a good one. Nick Starling is joining us live now from TCU with all of the excitement out there. Nick, how are you? Good, yeah, very excited and electric atmosphere indeed here in Fort Worth on a TCU campus, especially in the first year of head coach Sonny Dykes. A lot of people didn't think the team would be as good as it is now, but we're halfway through the season, 6-0. and oh, There's so much excitement here. Adding to this excitement, it's homecoming weekend. Go Frogs! Go frogs. Horn Frog fever is here. Now that we're 6-0, we're riding and we're riding high. Martin Verschel is part of the Dutchman, a spirit group for the student section. Oh, smack it, a hey, flip it, a hey, rub it down. The mighty Horn Frogs are the best in town. His energy highlights just how passionate this fan base is, as the Horn Frogs are undefeated so far this season. The students are getting louder and louder and showing up more and more and it is just an incredible feeling. I always say for the whole game, but it's, it's just so much better when we win and you can be excited about it. We weren't expecting yeah, it either. Yeah, expecting to go this far. 6-0 yeah. is pretty amazing. I think Sonny's done a fantastic job. He's got the guys playing great, and I don't see anything but all the way to the top. Steve and Gina Mertz flew from California to watch the game with their daughter who attends TCU. We're excited about the big game, K-State. We're going to take you down. <laughs> take you down. The wins mean big business for this pop-up t-shirt shop, Fans Vintage. I think that's that's definitely the case, so no, no complaints from us that we're doing so well. It's a fan base re-energized, taking the Big 12 by storm. It's absolutely electric, you know, to see this kind of like joy and energy and excitement back in the fan base has been phenomenal. And they are selling a lot of black shirts because tomorrow's game is a blackout if you're a TCU fan because the other guy is Kansas State. They also wear purple, so that's a way to stand out. The game is tomorrow night at 7 o'clock, and there are still some tickets available if you want to come to the game tomorrow night. Live at TCU, Nick Starling, CBS 11 News. So exciting for them. Yeah, it's going to be great out there yeah. tomorrow. Nick, thank you very much. Also.